All right, folks, welcome back to another fantastic edition of Opalite Presents Know Your Pros. And today's guests, we have Drew and Toby, the squeaky clean students of Moore Park, California. The squeaky clean students, the name uh, gives you an idea of what they do. They clean windows throughout Ventura County, and they offer fantastic services to young guys here to make it happen. They are licensed and insured. Boys, the squeaky clean students, it is a thrill to have you both join us today. Thank you Thanks. for having me. Yeah, Toby, Drew, we've got you guys both in here today. Um, I talked to you dudes for probably a good half hour before we even decided to start shooting here. Um, I, when I first saw you dudes, really wanted to understand like why you were doing it, what the larger meaning behind what your business is all about. Um, but I wanted to hear that story straight from the horse's mouth. Um, why did you guys decide to go out and say, hey, we're starting our own business today? Give me that story. So we've always been pretty entrepreneurial minded, especially over like quarantine. We'd always be playing video games together, talking about businesses, reading books. And it was always we've always been uh, having that desire to learn. And we decided what's what a better way to learn than to start something. So. We just decided to just finally just say, hey, let's go. Let's start it up. So we decided window cleaning. <laughs> well, so when most people like dive in and take the plunge, they get, you know, shocked immediately, right? Like they they like go, oh my gosh, I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, and they might like put it down as quickly as they picked it up. But it seems like you guys have gotten over the initial launch and you brought it into something that's like, you know, relatively successful that, you know, is a well-respected business in Park. I mean, can you guys give me a little bit of insight into like what it was like in those first few months um, as a couple of high school kids starting a window cleaning business? Yeah, sure. So basically we started it and then we were just like, went around asking, knocking on doors and being like, hey, do you need your gutters clean? Because we needed capital to start the window cleaning because window cleaning supplies cost more than gutter clean cleaning supplies. And then once we got our feet off the ground, a little more knowledge in our heads and courage, we just started cleaning windows and then we just kept, kept building up. Yeah, and you said that those first few jobs, like, I mean, I've got a lot of respect for this and I'm sure the people out there will too, but like, you've kind of got to jump out of the plane and build the parachute on the way down. Most people like to focus on building that parachute and then jumping out of the plane. Like you told me that she started with those first few gutter cleaning jobs to get that capital, you know, um, and now you've come to a place where you're like licensed and you're insured and, you know, you've got that peace of mind that you can offer to homeowners, which is amazing. Um, so like, tell me then why that, why window cleaning? Like, what was the attraction of window cleaning? You know, was it like smelling like soap suds all the time that kind of like, you know, you thought, Hey man, like this, this could be a way to, you know, I don't know where that joke's going, but like, what was the attraction? <laughs> so we kind of thought, what does everyone have? Well, everyone has windows and we live in a beautiful area, California got the sunshine state, even though it's not super sunny right now, but uh, you always want to have your windows shining and squeaky clean so you can see out of them and always see the sunrise and always see the sunset. Yeah, nobody likes looking through a dusty window. Um, yeah. As a squeegee owner myself, um, I can sympathize with that. And yeah, I mean, it is a needed service, right? Like folks are always going to have dirty windows. Um, Mother nature is never going to let up in that realm. Um, you guys, though, I think it's really cool to point out, not only do you just have a window cleaning business, um, but you have a window cleaning business with like a purpose and a cause. You know, you guys have an aim to give those that you hire on the job experience, right? Like you want to give them business knowledge um, and then also help them make a little bit of money. Can you tell me a little bit about like the squeaky clean students, larger goals here? Yeah, sure. So, so, oh. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm running this one. So actually this Thursday, we're talking to like five high school students and like training them and teaching them a whole bunch of things that we have learned over the year. And hopefully, in the long run, we're going to have people under us that we could train as well. 
Yeah, Drew, you mentioned too that, you know, not only are owners of properties, you know, owners of commercial properties too, you know, getting their windows cleaned, but they're supporting a cause. Toby, you talked about like the kids that could potentially come and be working for you guys. But Drew, I mean, it sounded like you've already got that idea worked out in your mind, right? Yeah. So we want to uh, basically teach people about business, like what Toby said, give them some little experience, a little bit of knowledge and we want to end up paying those kids well. And so they can help pay for college tuitions, whether they're a high school student saving up for college or where they're a college student in college trying to pay off student loans. And we want to pay them well, give them the life experience. And so when you're buying our window cleaning, you're not only supporting a cause, but you're also getting your windows cleaned. That's so rad. Um, if that's not a perfect reason why you should call the squeaky clean students over any other window cleaner in Ventura County, I don't know what to tell you, you know, because you, you ain't got a heart, right? I mean, like these guys are the real deal. That's fantastic. Um, I, I want to ask a little bonus question of you guys, um, because we talked about this before we started shooting, but like, um, what are your guys' plans here for the future? How do you want to do it? I remember that you, Drew, mentioned there might be a split with college here on the horizon, but it sounds like the squeaky clean students could potentially become a, a franchise opportunity. I don't know. like, Yeah, so that's the plan with uh, the future. So when graduation comes along, I'm going to try to either go to the W.P. Carey School of Business at ASU or Cal State Long Beach. And maybe we could move the squeaky clean students to another area, franchise it up and get it going, maybe expand it a little bit. Yeah, and Toby, I mean, you would hold down uh, home base in Moore Park and Greater Ventura County, like when that comes comes to be? Exactly. Um, there's also the holding it here and having people that we hired here or people that we now are over and teaching and also maybe even another business that I could start up. Yeah. Well, I mean, I think as long as you guys have got the t-shirts, you've got the logo, you've got the business license, there's no reason why, you know, the business can't operate in multiple spaces. You know, I've heard about, you know, the starving students movers, but you guys are the squeaky clean students. You guys are the window cleaning arm of the student world. And that's rad, guys. Um, and again, you know, I've said this so many times when we started here, but like you guys are the reason why we shoot Know Your Pros. We want folks to understand who they're dealing with when they call the squeaky clean students, get a good sense before they give them a call. Um, and, you know, <laughs> you guys are you guys are rock stars. That's fantastic. Um, and Thank I got you. admiration for you both. Thank you. Of course. Of course. Well, so before we wrap this thing up, fellas, um, tell our viewers here where they can get in touch with you, how they can get a hold of squeaky clean students. If they're in Mo Moore Park or Ventura County, need some window cleaning action. Give us the scoop. Uh, plain and simple. All you have to do is go to Safari and look up squeaky clean students dot com. And that's you can find our social medias from there or a fill out a form for maybe even a, a quote. That's it. Beautiful. And you've got a phone number too. I uh, I used and abused it when I was, uh, you know, chomping at the bit to get you guys on the show. But <laughs> if you call 805-209-9681, that's, uh, that's the number to call if you want to quote, right? Yes, exactly. Beautiful. Beautiful. Well, great, fellas. Um, thank you both again so much for coming on. I think we shot a great show. But once again, we've got the squeaky clean students, Drew and Toby, the professional window cleaning enterprise out of Moore Park, California, Ventura County's best student window washers. This summer, when you're looking through that window at the sunset and you think, man, this view could be better, call the squeaky clean students. They're the guys you want to know. Fellas, thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you so much, Henry. Thank you. We will definitely contact you about the Google listings. <laughs> That's coming up next, folks. All right. <laughs> Until next time. Now you're pros.